see that big boy? Look at him. Should I try to catch him? I'm on. You're on. <laughs> no, 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 no. Hey guys, what's going on? We have a little bit of a different video for you. I am on a raft in the canal and I have a bucket full of fish carcasses and like guts and scraps and stuff from a fishing trip that we went on yesterday where Victor made a video of us fishing. And today I'm going to do something that a lot of you guys have asked me to do, which is to film the fish eating carcasses in the water. So instead of just being lazy and setting up a GoPro, <laughs> <laughs> I am on this raft and I'm going to attempt to feed the fish from the raft. We're going to see how that works. It's kind of big and leaves like a big shadow at the bottom and I think the fish are kind of scared of it. <laughs> That's what I'm noticing so far so I'm not sure how this is going to go yet. I do have one GoPro set up on this ladder so that's stationary. And then I have a GoPro with me. And then Victor's filming there so we got a bunch of different angles for you guys. I think I'm going to try to tie one of these fish on a rope and have it hanging down from my raft. <laughs> And hopefully all the fish start coming to the raft. A lot of times the water in the canal is kind of disgusting and like mucky, but today is actually very clear. So it's actually a very good day to do this. So let's get to it. <laughs> what do you uh, expect to see down there? Um, lots of catfish, snapper, probably some jacks if the jacks aren't scared of me on the raft. <laughs> I'm going to attempt to tie this tail up. a shark comes and eats it. That would be epic. <laughs> it would literally drag me around because it's connected to my tube. Rook's floating away. I have my emergency paddle. There's a stingray right underneath you, Brooke. Stick the GoPro straight down, straight down. Yeah, right there. Right there. So we had the carcass hanging straight up and down, but they didn't seem to like that, did they, Brooke? No, they didn't. So Victor let it out some, and now they're ripping it apart. They're still kind of timid and don't really know what to do, <laughs> but they're here now. Wow. They're like piranhas, aren't they? Yeah. Literally, there's probably 75 catfish in the canal right now. The whole bottom over there is just catfish. And as they rip it to shreds, it's just getting... Oh my gosh, oh. look at that one! He's doing a death roll! And as they rip it to shreds, it's just getting... Oh my gosh, look at that one! He's doing a death roll! Oh my gosh, look at that one! Oh my gosh, look at that one! They're about to rip the head off. Oh, they ripped the head off. That means they're going to probably drag the head out. Look how cloudy it is now. Okay, so here's a little update on the carcass. They ripped the head off within, I don't know, a minute. <laughs> And they ate a lot of the bones already. A lot of the meat. I'm gonna throw it back in. All the guts. All the guts are gone, yeah. That was a good snapper. I don't 
go out. So I'm going to just come back and fix it. When we first started we had very good sun and light and it just started raining all of a sudden. <laughs> That's Florida for you. We had perfect sun and then like, I don't know, 15 minutes later now it's raining and it's really shadowed so hopefully you can still see good. But this is what we got going on with our carcass now, our kingfish carcass. I'd say they're doing a pretty good job on it. <laughs> they're kind of dragging and ripping it all over the place. They've now taken the head out deep so I can't see the head anymore but that's all that's left with this <laughs> they're gonna like this can I lay it right here mm -hmm. wow and Look another another weird thing is they keep like getting the catfish keep getting scared I don't know what's scaring them. Like, I won't even move, and all of a sudden they just disappear for like a few seconds. And then um, they'll come back in like full force, but they'll go out and there won't be any. And then they'll come back. I don't know if they like scare themselves or something, or if something else is here that's scaring them. Yes, this dolphin is kind of small, but he's legal. <laughs> they have to be 20 inches to keep, and he was 22. So, yes, he's legal. He's just kind of small. It's crazy when the catfish come in and they go crazy over the carcass. They throw up so much dirt and muck off the bottom that it, like you can barely see. Okay. It's dolphin dinner time. <laughs> I wonder if any of the neighbors are watching me on this <laughs> raft wondering what the heck I'm There's doing. a crazy girl on a raft with a GoPro. Okay, you ready? So one thing I noticed since Brooks in the raft is the catfish and all the other fish don't seem to care about the carcasses when it's just like one or two pecking at it. It's you don't see just one fish pecking at it. It's like all or nothing. They get each other fired up and I think especially since catfish don't have very good eyesight, they feed by scent. So when that carcass is getting mutilated, it's throwing the guts and flesh and everything in the water and they're just get into a feeding frenzy, which fish do, which I thought is pretty cool. They don't, it's not like one's greedy and is gonna swim off with the carcass. They all attack it at once and kind of work together to rip the meat off of it and do these violent head shakes and stuff. I'll tell you what, the snapper aren't as like nervous as the catfish, which is weird, you know? Like the snapper will kind of like come right up to my GoPro, but like I move this stick in front of the catfish and they freak out. I think they're more sensitive to feeling since they can't see so good. It's so crazy that a, a catfish, I just filmed it, will suck in the entire skin of the mahi in one bite. We'll just suck the entire thing in. Also, I thought the jacks were gonna come. They haven't really came.
what the dolphin looks like as of now. All the guts are gone, correct? Yep. It's sunny now that I am done filming. That is Florida in a nutshell for you. I hope you guys liked this different kind of video. If you did, comment down below and make sure to like the video. Maybe if you guys like it, I will next time go in the water and film <laughs> from inside the water. As always, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. I say uh, everyone comment below if you want to see Brooke feeding the catfish with her toes next time from the rack. No I think way. that'll be a real winner. No. Well, I was rinsing off my GoPro and like an idiot, I was doing it over the water and I dropped it in the water and I went to try to get it out and some 15, 20 pound jacks started swimming around and they're not eating the carcass, they're just swimming around, but they're big, solid, nice jacks. There's probably like 12 of them and the crazy thing is that there's no catfish anymore. No catfish anymore, just big jacks p patrolling around. Pretty cool. I wish they were there while I was in the water, but they're too smart to go in while I was probably on the raft. Look at them. Big boys. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> okay, so I just cut off some bloodline from the kingfish that Victor filleted. And watch this. Oh my gosh. I'm trying to throw them under the dock because the glare is so bad. Ooh. Oh, that was a little one. Look at that big boy. Look at him. That's probably the biggest one. Look at him. Should I try to catch him? I should try to catch him. Should I try to catch him? What? Should I try to catch him? Now the thing about jacks is they're very smart. You have one chance to do this and that's it. So I have a chunk on. I'm gonna toss a chunk out, then toss my chunk out. You ready? I'm gonna toss over there where they've been eating this whole time. Oh, oh. my gosh. I'm on. You're on. No, 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 <laughs> You got two more, you got another rod rig. He literally went, whoop. <laughs> he was so smart. Did you see that? Oh, the whole world saw it. Oh, that was stupid. I, he went, why did you toss it? You had to toss it in the middle. Well, I don't know. There's so many times where you're feeding jacks out here. The second you throw a line in the water, they just know it, they see it, they're smart, and they just won't eat it. So, I don't know, I just literally tossed it right there. <laughs> he ate it and just went whoosh, right around the piling. Should I try again? Yeah. I just tossed the piece in and the only thing's eating it is the catfish. I'm telling you, that's it. I had one shot. They're not gonna come back. They're so smart. Once they get that big, they've been around docks and people on, in fillet tables, people throwing stuff in, trying to catch them. They're literally just so smart. You have one chance, and even if there's 12 of them, one gets hooked and they just know it and they're gone. 
I think that was my one chance and I <laughs> messed up. <laughs> oh no, I just got myself all wet. I think you're gonna be getting wet the whole time. Did you see that? My hair just went into the bucket of guts. <laughs> oh, Brooke. The things you do. Ready? Ready. Ready? Freddy, Ready, Freddy set, go! It's like I just fallen. <laughs> Good day, there's not a lot of planes today. But anyways, now I have to figure out how to get the GoPro out of the water without going in the water because I don't want to do that. <laughs>